say, okay, now you can discuss it. But before you receive anything, Newsom has to say, okay, that's called a handout. See, we as a people need to stop fighting for handouts and learn that these are legal matters, not handouts. But you wouldn't know about that. You want trick or treat candy. I get it, but carry on. All right, so you're done, right? Because the, the legal part is the complicity. And that, that's what makes, <laughs> that's actually a legal term. So you, you, I wanted you to pull it up because I don't want to debate about facts if if we just pull why should things, i pull up something that you're talking about we yeah, already know what you, complicit is but you only right, be so you only can be complicit like you if you, you only can be complicit if there is legal ramifications so i'm that's why i'm trying to pull it up and show you the legal you're not trying to pull it up you came I, here you don't want to show it. your face Oh, come on, man. Look, dude, you, you came here like this. I didn't tell you come look, here like this. All right. Let's just talk about. All right. Let's just talk about what I came up here to talk about, because now you're going somewhere else. I, I thought you was really talking about reparations. But I am, brother. Reparations is a legal matter. Right, so, yeah. So when you're complicit in crimes committed against humanity, you are also liable. Now we're not going to debate that. Now let's move on to the next part because you can either bro, in you order, either, in order, you can in either order, believe the truth or not. But bro, in talking, order, brother, in look, order, you, you keep cutting me off because every time I make a point and I try to finish a sentence, I go and finish go, your point. You go and make a speech. Finish your and point. I already, I already know that you, you the ops, and you might as well go over there with Coleman Hughes and them because you sound just like him and you arguing okay. the same talking points. Okay. That Coleman Hughes been been spewing ever since he was up there on the hill with Sheila Jackson Lee and them. So I see you with 3D glasses. But let me finish my thought so you'll have something to opine at least. Because right now, it seems as though you're the one that's illustrious. This dude is dumb as a box of rocks. This dude is dumb as a box of rocks. And I'm not going to entertain this crazy, idiotic fool. This guy is a dumb, idiotic fool family, and I will not entertain it. <laughs> I've been waiting for you all day. What's your name? A little white boy to make my bottom bitch with a little accent. Is that like UK? Yes. And I'm not a bottom. <laughs> <laughs> You're not tough enough to be a top little baby, so calm down. You're a bottom. I'm not a bottom, though. Okay, you say that until you're on the bottom. Are you sure you're not the bottom? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm not gay. Um, so how would you know what a bottom is? Because that's what the other men are when I'm in the room with them. If you're oh, yeah, a pitcher, so. you're not gay. You're only gay if you're receiving. It's new rules. It's 2022. Huh? You're funny. Wait, but if you're not a bottom, then that means you're straight too. So you should get rid of that pride flag. No, it's for the other bottoms to come in. <gasps> so you're trying to like do like a Venus flytrap and get all the bottoms in here so that you can ravage their behinds? Oh, you predator, you. Oh, Lord. You're like Ted Bundy or something. No, I'm more like Jeffrey Dahmer. Oh, hide your kids, hide your wife. I have to ask you, though. I have to ask you. This stays between us, okay? But what's the youngest you've had? I don't have sex with young people. What's the youngest you've had? I don't have sex with young people. What's the youngest you've had? I think you're lying. It took you too long to say that. I don't know. I've had sex with a lot. Of oh, I knew it, guys. I'm fine. Nothing. What about you? Oh my gosh, I'm doing better now. You're like so cute. Oh, thank you. Where are you from? You too. Oh my gosh, I'm from like wherever you are because that's where I want to be. <laughs> 
Don't blush now. Don't blush now. But I have to ask you. I have to ask you. Your name is Cookie, right? No. It says Cookie. No, my, my name is Milk. Not the cookie, that's the milk. No, no, no. I want you to be the cookie because I'll bring the milk. Yeah. Oh. I've got the milk for you. 2%. I hope you're not lactose intolerant. Where are you from again? Oh my gosh, you're so silly. I told you I'm from like wherever you are. What is it like the Philippines, Thailand? <laughs> Yeah. Listen, listen, listen. I'm just going to get straight to the point, okay? Here in the U.S. of A., I'm known kind of as a local celebrity. I'm known as the booty warrior. I take booty. Booty is more important than water. Booty is more important than food. Booty is more important than breathing. And let's just say I came across you and I must have your booty. So we can do this the easy way or the hard way. It's up to you. Sir, sir, look at me. Look at me. May I have your booty? No. <gasps> Why not? Because I don't want to get, uh, to share my booty. <laughs> <gasps> but sharing is caring. Who said that? That is wrong. <laughs> <gasps> whoa, 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 whoa. I've never been stood down before. This is a first. Normally, when I solicit men for their booties they just put it in the air and say here take it so i must ask you what is it about me is it because i'm black congrats on the first is it because i'm black are you afraid that your tiny little sphincter won't handle the black mamba well my truth is how i express myself so you why Leo, you can't indicate may i ask you a question please you like? May I ask yes. you a question? Yes. Have you ever tasted the taint of a man? No. Then how do you know you don't like it if you haven't tried it? It's like a new ice cream flavor. You don't know you like it until you have a sample. Have you ever killed anyone? We were talking about sex, not murder. <laughs>